a look at the odds board for the upcoming second race. Run for the money, leaving on the rail with Jill Barrio at 9-2. to two. J.J. Amelia is two for Adam Erner at 5-2. to two. Heather's Pat leaving three with Corey McPherson at 3-1. to one. Kay's Ryder four for Miles Heffernan at 2-1. to one. And it's model time, leaving five. Kenny Murphy in the bike, right now your current choice at 6-5. to five. That is your field for the upcoming second race. Don't get shut out at the windows. Good luck with your selections. I want to give a shout out to a couple of guys I know watch the races all the time. Lorne Stewart and Huey Murphy. Saw Huey yesterday getting his hair cut. So a shout out to you guys watching all the action this afternoon. As a field of five approaches the Metro Home Building Center starting gate, let's go back upstairs to Vance Cameron. Well, I can tell you one thing, Rocky. You are on a roll after that first race triactive with the chalk choice to pay six fifty and change. You with all three of them right there on the line. So good luck to you on this. Saturday afternoon. Here comes the second. Run for the money. J.J. Amelia Heather's pet case writer. It's model time. Here they come. Rough and pacing. Heather's pet will leave out on the rail. Run for the money. Third one to the turn is case writer. Getting away fourth is J.J. Amelia. Then the early trailer. That's its model time. As they arrive at the opening eighth, Heather's pet is the leader. It might be short-lived. To her outside and driving on the outside is Kay's Ryder about to take over for Miles Senior. Second is Heather's pet. Third run for the money, racing from fourth. J.J. Amelia, it's model time. Is fifth. They're over to the quarter pole, and it's Kay's Ryder out in front. Heather's pet races from second. A little gap to third run for the money there. 29 and for the quarter, racing from fourth is J.J. Amelia trailing the field. It's model time on by the 3 h pole, and Kay's Ryder is the fraction center on route to the opening half mile. Heather's pet in the two-hole, racing in mid-pack. Third is run for the money. Going to the outside, fourth is J.J. Amelia trailing the field. It's model time, fifth. They're halfway home in the second. Kay's Ryder, the midway point leader. Heather's pet second, first up. J.J. Amelia there, third. Coming fourth on the outside, it's model time. And now the trailer, run for the money. The half mile in 101. Over to the 5-H, K's right at the rail, the leader. To her outside, racing second is J.J. Amelia in the pocket, third. Heather's pet, it's model time. It's taken over fourth, trailing the field, but not out of it. Run for the money, fifth, quarter of a mile out. K's right here, continuing to lead, reclaiming second. Heather's pet on the outside. Now a stall third is J.J. Amelia. Fourth and coming three wide. It's model time. Run for the money. Fifth. Three quarters up in one. 31 and one. Homeward bound. And it's Kay's Ryder trying to see it through. Heather's pet up the inside second. It's model time on the far outside. On the wire next. Heather's pet. It's model time on the outside with Kenny Murphy. Then Heather's pet and Cade Ryder, 2 all, one and one. Here comes a slow-mo replay for the afternoon second race brought to you by Universal Media. My top choice, Kay's Ryder, went to the front, and the track looks wet out there and a little bit sloppy in places, Vance. 29 and 4 to the quarter of the half in 101. Down to three quarters in 131 and 1. Here comes its model time on the far outside. Heather's pad in the passing lane, I thought was going to get up to get it all. This its model time, four race winning streak now, flying on the outside off the camera. You can't see her here, but she's going to get up to win on this wet track. In 201 and 1 this afternoon. In for second, that is the three. Heather's pet. Kay's Rider will settle for third. We got 5 3 4 in the afternoon second race. We'll see its model time. And Kenny Murphy back in the winner's circle next.
Well, this mare took her time to get to the races, but it looks like she was worth the wait as she just picks up her fourth consecutive victory. That's its model time in the second. Bay pacing mare five by Stonebridge Terror off the Badlands Hanover Dam model legs. A homebred of Robert Phillips of Lose Route 204. Robert does the training. Kenny Murphy guides her to victory in 201 and a one-fifth. It's model time, four in a row at Charlottetown.